Hola, ¿qué hay? ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo estáis? ¿Bien? Bien, me alegro. Ok, número 8, number 8 of the audio and video range for building your verbs now. Ok, so we're going really rocking and rolling now, we're into the M's. And uh, I'm going to run through this quickly because we've got a few extras here. First one is to look, ok, or to watch. To look or to watch. And that verb is mirar, mirar. Ok, mirar. Now, easy. Just imagine yourself looking at yourself in the mirror. Mirar in the mirror. Okay? So you look at yourself to look in the mirror. Mirar. Perfect. Easy. Next one is to move. Now this is to move house. Okay? To move house. This isn't to move yourself. It's different. Move house. And that one is mudarse. Mudarse. Okay? It's got the word mud at the beginning. So imagine that you're moving house and you're moving to a mud hut. Imagine taking all of your stuff into a mud hut. Mudarse. Excellent. Moving on. Next one is to need. To need. And that verb is necesitar. Necesitar. Or necesitar. Okay. Now we already have a, 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 a word like that, which is necessity, isn't it? Necessity. So it's a necessity to learn to need. Necesitar or necesitar. Okay. Excellent. Next one, this is very, very difficult. The verb to organize and it is organizar or organizar. Okay, it's just got an R on the end. So it's the same, isn't it? So you don't need anything to remember that one. Organizar, organizar, organize. To organize. The next one is this one. To pay. To pay. Importantly. Eh? Pagar. Pagar. So, how are you going to remember that one? When you pay in a supermarket, for example, you pay and bag. Pay and bag. Pay and bag. Pagar. Okay. Pagar. Now this one, okay, is to seem, to seem, and it's parecer, all right? To seem. Now, parecer. Now we've already learned a verb, aparecer, okay, which is to appear. And then we've got a verb to seem, which is parecer, okay? And you know when we say, it looks like, it looks like. This is the verb that you use. It seems, all right? So, parecer. So another parrot, it's got another parrot on. So you can look and just say, imagine a parrot and you say, well, that parrot seems to be a little bit sad. Okay, parecer, 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 all right? Bien, next one. To spend or to pass time. So to spend time or to pass time, okay? Can you hear the word? Pass time. We have that word, don't we? So do the Spanish. And the verb is pasar, pasar. Okay, so that pasar can be just to pass. It can also be to pass when you say, I pass. You ask a question, you say, I pass, okay? And it can be to spend time, right? Because rather than spending it, which is a metaphor, by the way, it's not real, we don't spend time, it's not money even though they, they tell us that, um, we actually could use the word to pass time. I'm going to pass time with my family. Pasar, okay? And then last one is to think, to think, okay? Which is pensar, pensar. Now, lots of people use the pen when they want to think. Have you seen them in the, in the kind of bang the pen on the, on the mouth sometimes? That's, mm, Mm, or on the head, mm, to think, pensar. So they use a pen to think. So imagine using a pen, banging your head to think. Pensar. 
Okay. Now, there you are. So we whizzed through those. I'm going to check you out now. I shall say the Spanish verb. You tell me what it is in English. Ready? So we've got mirar, mirar. And you're looking in the mirror and it's to look, to look or to watch, okay? Mirar. And then we've got mudarse, mudarse. And yeah, you're taking all of your stuff and you're moving to a mud hut. So it's to move house, mudarse. Then we've got necesitar or necesitar which is what? It's a necessity to learn this verb to need. So necesitar, necesitar, sorry, is to need. Next one, organizar. Now, come on, what's that? Um, you must be racking your brains. Organizar, organizar, to organize, okay. And then this one, pagar, pagar, okay. What's that one? Well, when you go to the supermarket, you pay in your bag, pay in your bag. So, pagar is to pay, pagar. And then we've got this one, parecer or parecer, parecer. And that is, when you look at that parrot, you see that parrot seems to be sad. So parecer is to seem or to look like, yeah. Okay. And then pasar, pasar, which is to pass or to spend, for example, time. Okay. And then the last one, pensar, pensar, with your pen there on your head, to think. Pensar is to think. Okay. Muy bien, chicos. Hey. Audio numero ocho de los verbos. So we've got to number eight on the verbs and we're going to move on to video nine now. So I'll see you there. Nos vemos allí. Hasta luego chicos. Adios. Mm -hmm.